Hello and welcome back to Vermont Craft Tours. I'm Sarah Scully and I have a recipe for you um, for what I make for lunch uh, most of the time. Um, so this uh, plan for quinoa salad um, was actually something my mother came up with and had been making for herself and once I started making it for my own lunches um, I really liked it and I realized how versatile and healthy it is. So um, quinoa is one of those um, kind of health foods that gets made fun of a lot, but it's it's actually a really healthy and delicious thing. Um, it's a whole grain in and of itself, and I think it's the only um, grain that does have all of the amino acids, so it's a whole protein as well. Um, and it's kind of nutty flavored, and but it's also a good base for any kind of um, flavor profile you want to put with it. So if you want to make something tangy or spicy or sweet, um, it really plays well with other flavors. And it's pretty easy to cook. Um, I just make my quinoa in the rice cooker on the regular white rice setting, and it does a fantastic job. So what you'll need for this recipe, and again, the ingredients and all the details will be in the show notes in the link below this video, um, but what you'll need is uh, about a cup of cooked quinoa. I usually put in a can of uh, white beans of some kind, often chickpeas, because those are also high in protein. Um, but you could use um, cannellini beans or navy beans, any kind of white bean. Um, and then the vegetables of your choice and any kind of um, sauce or dressing that you want to put on it. So I'll give you some ideas. Um, in the summertime, I like a nice cold, crunchy salad. So I'll often do carrots and celery or red peppers and celery um, with an Italian style dressing. And in the wintertime, I'd like something warm to have um, for lunch. And so I'll put in um, a winter vegetable medley, usually something like sweet potatoes and Brussels sprouts or lately I've been doing a lot of broccoli and delicata squash. Um, you could do butternut squash, you could do cabbage, um, and that I'll usually dress with a creamy style dressing like goddess dressing um, or tahini sauce. Um, and it's really, really good and warm and satisfying. Um, you can just microwave it. So the recipe does make quite a few servings, usually three or four. Um, and that's another another great thing I like about it. Um, you can make a big batch of this on, you know, at the beginning of the week, and then have it for several lunches ready to go. Just portion it out, and you're ready to run out the door. Um, so if you're looking for a quick and easy recipe for lunch, I hope you'll um, try out the quinoa salad. Let me know what you think. Let me know what flavor combinations you like. Um, and this also does make a nice side dish to go with other meals. So you could also try it for dinner. Thanks again for tuning in. Be sure to subscribe to our video series for more recipes and tips, and I'll see you next time.